Imagine this, a college community coming together for one day to show its stuff. It's happening tomorrow, and more than 20,000 people are expected for Imagine RIT. Two or three minutes. Ice cream created with liquid nitrogen? This one's vanilla. Vanilla? We'll have chocolate tomorrow, too. All right, here we go. Oh, chocolate and vanilla tomorrow. Yep. A computer hooked to a toy to turn photos into etch-a-sketch images. And a hybrid vehicle with batteries running on wind power. How fast will it go? Um, at the moment, it would go roughly around uh, 25, 30 miles an hour. And how far on a charge? And if you're driving just on uh, the batteries, it would go uh, 10 to 12 miles. Tomorrow's second Imagine Our IT Festival will go a long way to showing the community what this school is all about. Our IT is a kind of special place full of left-brainers and right-brainers, as I like to say. And this festival is an attempt to communicate to the broader public and even within our own constituency uh, all the incredible innovative and creative work going on on campus where we like to say the left brain and the right brain meet here. That means the arts and technology and science all together. Last year's Imagine RIT attracted some 20,000 visitors. Tomorrow, from 10 to 5, they might get 25,000. What I really love is to see somebody come to this campus and say, I had no idea these things were going on. I never knew the RIT Cycling Club could make smoothies with pedal power, but yeah, they can. Parking will be free on campus tomorrow and there's shuttle service from MCC. And it's free to get in. Imagine that. Imagine that. And that hybrid vehicle I drove this morning is going to be part of a contest that the president put on as a challenge. Uh, some visitors tomorrow will be able to take a test drive on some of those vehicles, too. I'd get there early for that, though. I never knew. I ne so many things were happening that. in RIT. What was your favorite thing? Uh, I liked riding that hybrid, bike. how do you say it, recumbent, recumbent bike, recumbent bike uh, because it had a little throttle on it, and it, w it felt very stable, and I would not mind driving it to work. Okay. However, <laughs> I might live take too, you a I live few too days. far away. <laughs>